Hey, yo, where Nick at? Back there in the cut. Travis on the hill, I play at College Hill High School in Swanee, Georgia, class of 2022. Best player in the nation. Ready, go, go, man. Some say corner, some say receiver. I grew up in West Palm Beach, Florida. Members of this community tell me something needs to be done. At the, in West Palm Beach, at the boat ramps at Curry Park I came in West Palm to Georgia Beach. like my eighth grade year, so I've been out here for about four years now, but I'm going back. I'm going back home. But I grew up in uh, West Palm Beach, Florida. I moved out because there was a lot of killing, a lot of shootings. It wasn't just, it just wasn't the right fit for me. A lot of drug dealing and all that. It's just a bad environment. So well, I moved up here just to get a better opportunity at life. No, we will lock you up. Yes, he will. Yes, he will. All right. Will. Will. Let him know, man. Yeah, man. Keep going. 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 Ah. I'm from West Palm Beach, but I grew up in Boynton Beach, really. And the area I grew up in is like, it ain't a good place to be at. It's really, it's really bad right now. A lot of people getting killed every other day down there right now. The shoulder was up, not like that. Ah, ah. Oh, my schedule, like, uh, yeah, I go to school from 7 to 2. We got practice after school at 3 o'clock to like 5.30. Go to Go to the car park there at 2.30, I mean at 6.30, and then by the time I get from the car park there, after the two days out of the week, and then I go training about two days out of the week too. I go one time during the week, like if we got school, I go to, I go to practice at the, I go to training at the practice, and it's like practice from, on Thursday we have like an hour and a half practice. After that hour and a half practice, I go to training, and then I go to training on Sunday. Every time. CJ about to get hard. Oh my gosh. Outside receiver over here. You got to switch it up. Outside. You got to get that. I said, I said, CJ. Well, the last time I was home before I moved up here, no, I wasn't really training. I was really out there fishing. I was fishing with my cousin before I knew it. Like, I was moving up here. My, my uh, mom told me that we'd be going to Georgia, but she ain't never told me we was moving up here. So I thought it was just a family trip. But then we ended up moving. We ended up staying and like, I wasn't really training down there. I was just going to practice playing football, really, because my dad had went to prison. But it's some good parts down there, but it ain't too many good parts. Most of it's really bad. It's a lot of killing down there right now. You can't really do anything. And if you trying to play ball down there, you really, it's really hard to like make it out from down there. But you messing up. I'm gonna tell you how you keep messing up. You give yourself no room on the sideline. You was in out of bounds already. All right, all right, cool, 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 but... It's still, <laughs> bro, it don't matter, bro. You out of bounds, you not available right, cool, in the play no more. I'm a, it's a goal. It's not, I'm not running that way. I'm running the goal. Bro, you know, I, I was in bounds. Yes, you was out of bounds. Oh, you gotta do this. You can slow the step back. By the time you step back, I'm still gonna be on Sam, no, I understand bro. what you're saying, bro. But that, no, I under her. I understand what you're saying. I wasn't really a recruit because I came out of Florida. And ain't nobody know me. I was like the new kid on the block that was real good. So like when I got up here, my ninth grade year, I played all right. But my 10th grade year is really when I really like, that's when people really started noticing that I could play football. I always played varsity. Play, I think I played like one or two games at JV. And I played like a quarter at JV. I caught a pick and then they took me out and they never play again. <laughs> All right, so good. I say I started my ninth grade year, like mid-season, when our corners got hurt, and then they put me in there. So I just started since then. Uh, what I did in the summer, and I'm going to the 10th, I worked out every day with my, my trainer. His name uh, DJ Mad Science, and we call him Coach Drew. He got my footwork right, got my speed right, and got me. He just got me to doing what I needed to do. He got my footwork right, route running, locking up DB. I mean receivers. It just he put a lot into me. 
Yeah, I was always athletic. I, I believe I dunked, my, my first dunk was in uh, eighth grade. I dunked my coach threw me an alley in eighth grade practice and I dunked it. So like, I always knew I was gonna be very athletic. I used to play football all the time in eighth grade, even though I couldn't play in like the season or nothing. So I just played in my backyard with my little brother. Let's go Blazer Auburn. I want one. Ready? Good, good, good. Oh, baby. Oh, rip it out, rip it out. Good, good, good. good. Hey, baby, oh, rip it out, rip it out. Good, good, good. good. Oh, hey, yeah, I was always a two-way player, even in Little League. I played, I started off playing nose guard to get the, uh, my dad wanted me to get physical, so I started playing nose guard, then they moved me to offensive tackle, then I went to running back, and then I went to receiver, then I went to DB, and I just always been playing receiver and DB since, look, since I was little. Uh, I won't say I worked on any drills, I would just say I worked on my overall game. I just worked on everything. I had to get better in everything. If I wanted to be the best, I gotta work on everything. So my trainer made sure I worked on everything. I worked on speed, feet work, running routes, just covering, getting out, in and out my brakes, turning, all that. Chris, you went here. You went here instead of to the middle. Hey, 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 we're gonna go to Dante. We gotta throw the inner side. That's what I mean. That's how I do everything the time. Clam! Clam! Good job, man! Good job! Man. Oh, fight the ball! Oh, where the play, baby! Where the play! Listen, sir, if you buy in, you can be good. But you gotta buy in. You can't. I'm saying, what make them think? They, I'm gonna play like linebacker, like I would love to, but I'm too small. Like, just get it in. Be, uh, just be, just be aggressive. Be looking, look, look, look. Look, look they, I put me in linebacker. The they said, Oh yeah, Malik. Make Quarterback set him up though. Quarterback set him up. He went. Yeah. Mente went. Yeah. Boom. Just like that. Right. Talk about saying, no, no. He was already on. He didn't look like. How? Weirdo. You gotta be quick because you know Sam Romeo. In the fuck, cause he don't think you're going to, on the go, and you got 10 more yards to go. So I had to go route. All right, so yeah, take off there. You gotta understand what he like. He like he wouldn't even chase him. He just waited. You gotta understand. If he's scared, you gotta just do it all the way. Just go straight. Go, Claudio. Go, Claudio. I'm about to sneeze, bro. I'm about to sneeze. Bless you. I ain't sneezing yet. I ain't sneezing no more. Cause you said bless you. I'm just saying it went away. Cause you said bro, bro. I'm just saying it just went away. Ready? Go. Hey! 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 
you going? Yeah. You got it. You got it. You got to go pay. You got to pay. You got to pay. You got to pay the price. You pay that price then. It ain't nothing but $12. You said what? It sounded that hard too. You finna um, 50 ball in the first, first half, you know. And then um, we're going to let our freshman and JV finish that game. That's how I feel. I'm with Devin, but that boy Devin over there tired. DC! I ain't turned around. Hey! 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 I'm going to a car practice I'm Saturday. I'm finna go to massage thing. I'm finna go to a car practice massage and all that. I'm finna get that jump. Saturday. When you get to college, you're gonna be skinny big. Oh, yeah. You're gonna be like that dude that lost that 300, I mean, that 600 pound. And my all season, my ninth grade year at the practice, I went to training every day. We had a training schedule I had to go to every day, except for Sunday. No, except for Saturdays, because Sundays we, we trained every day. And then 10th grade, pretty much the same thing. And then 11th grade, I went to training every often. But this year, I went to training almost every, every three days I went to training. So like I went to training at least two times a week. And I still go to train the end season. What made you like do that or train or like tell like? Nah, my trainer didn't tell me. He didn't tell me, but he just told me he needed. He told me I needed to start fixing up little things. Ever since then, once he told me that, I was just going and working and keep working and keep working. I don't really do nothing. I love to play football and I love to fish. I only do two things: I either go fishing or I'm playing the game or I'm playing football. So it's really two things, fishing and football, and I love to play football, so I just go to training when I, when I don't got nothing else to do. Well, I go to training when, it's, when football practice is over, I'm going to training. And if I ain't got nothing else to do, I'm gonna go fishing. That's how I stay out of trouble, too. Yeah, no, nah, I'm not no party guy. I barely hang out with my teammates outside of football. I, don't, I stay like about 20 minutes away from here, so I don't really hang out with them. I either play the game with them, I go fishing with them, or we at football practice. Yeah, it's just always been like that. Since, since growing up from Florida, you see a lot of things going, a lot of killing, a lot of people getting, going to jail and stuff like that, so I just always try to stay out the way and do what I have to do to get to the next level. My, my motivation is my family. My family, is they put a lot into me. They made sure I was always, always the good child. Make sure I did what I had to do and not be no bad person. So like seeing them actually sacrifice and, and my little brothers following my footsteps. So I just always had to put them first at everything I do. So ninth grade, I was unranked pretty much ain't nobody know of me. Then my ninth grade summer, like going into my 10th grade year, I started getting offers. Spring game, I got offers. And then I'll say, I got ranked, my first time being ranked, I was ranked the uh, number six player in the nation. See, I just go out there and play. I don't really care about the rankings. I just go out there and show people that I can do whatever I want. I can really play, I can play offense, I can play defense. If you need to play quarterback, I can play quarterback. Yeah, I'm all over the field and I don't get tired. My 10th grade year going to my 11th year, 11th grade year. I used to train every day 10th grade, like I said. And then 11th grade year, I backed off a little bit just to keep my body healthy. But 10th grade year, I realized, like, well, my 11th grade year, after that 10th grade year of training, that I had a big jump. Like, I was actually like one of the, I'm the best player in the country type jump. Like, I improved in so much stuff. Like, it's so much things that I improved in that nobody have seen. <laughs>
Huh? Lift and record the game. What you mean? That's how we do it right here. What does it do? No, I just get the blood flow. You just be ready to pump. That's that's really the main reason. Get the blood flowing. Automatic. Drive you running too much. He, he sucks. This 2K. Anybody want to send in 2K? See how they ignoring that 2K deal. See how they ignoring that 2K. I don't play 2K. I don't play 2K. Sandwich. No, I got two. This is my second one. Fat boy. Fat boy. You want it? You sure? I'll take it. You know who that guy is that, that make them bleed? What's the name down of Archie? Yeah. We have practice from 7 to 11 in the morning here, and then I go to training at 6 o'clock at night to like probably 9. We'll probably lift weights or so, but just really working on footwork, little things, working on a lot of little things. The whole experience was good. I ain't never been traveling that much, and 707, I had traveled a lot. I went to a good amount of states. I don't know what people confuse about me. That's what I want to know. Why, why I want to know why so many people that's confused that I'm not the number one player in the nation. Number one player in the nation. Number one athlete in the nation. Every season. Every so season. what number did you need? Every season. For everything. Eighteen hundred dollars, twenty-four touchdowns last year. In the season. nation. Look, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Look at me. Number one in the what? So I've been talking to you. I, I thought you were the number one in Georgia. You the nation. Hey man, look. I know I've been too sure been talking more crazy than you. <laughs> receiver in the NFL. Quote me when I say this. Receiver. So you can't hit. I want to be there tonight, man. You're going to see. You gonna see. All right. Do you have like a three game routine? Uh, yeah. No, not really. You got to go talk to these boys right quick, though. The teams, they've been canceling against you guys? Yeah, it's a lot of teams canceling against us. Some teams don't want to play us because they know what we got and what we can do. So a lot of teams just scared. They want to try to get to the playoffs. See, we trying to play everybody we can play. So, we had to go down to so, so next week you have to like schedule a game? Yeah. The last team we were supposed to play next, next week, they already canceled the game. So we're looking for a game right now. We're probably going to find a team out of Florida. Yeah. One thing I know that was surprising that I like to fish. I like to fish a lot. I really can go fishing every day. Yeah, I go during the season. Like earlier today, my team asked me when we going fishing again. They like, they see that I can, I go fishing almost every day. We pick Florida State is the bond that I have with the coaching staff, the football players. And I say, it's like the right fit for me because it's like right in the city, but then it's close to my hometown. Like it's close to my grandma and my whole, my whole family still stays in Florida. I just moved up with my stepdad and my mom and my two brothers and sister. On the field, I'm the same. I'm a goofball on the field with my teammates. I just want to make sure they having fun. If football ain't, it ain't good if you're not having fun. You're about to get it right tonight. What is that most man? Oh, this is my, this is my homeboy. He a different breed. He ain't got by himself. He, you don't see he got a pack. He ain't got no pack with him. He all oh. by himself, long wolf. Travis. Oh, you get sick of it? Do you want to sit with it? Nah, I need it. Oh, wait. Come on my plate. Mm. 
Mm, I don't know what that seasoning is. That's some other stuff right there. The seasoning was looking like pressure. <laughs> Are you gonna get two plates? I feel like we should have got a different. He might. Hell, no. like, well, get mad if I eat no shirt on. <laughs> butter the bread, at least. God, if you don't butter your bread, you. There's no but difference. Man. It tastes the same. Yeah. It's my boy Dad, bro. Smartest man out. Dad, what is your GPS? 3.5. What? 3.5. Do not act for it. That we will soar with the Eagles. And the boy that whatever the first is. My mindset was get offers. My mindset was get offers when I first moved to Georgia. Get offers and get my family to where they don't have to work again. That was my mindset and that still is my mindset. But I got offers now. It's just the next step is get my family to where they don't have to work ever again. My mom worked early in the morning. She dropped me off to school, she go to work. And then my stepdad work at nights. I see my mom probably a good two hours throughout the week, a day. I see about a good two hours throughout the week, a day. Cause she work and then I have practice in school. What you expect from you this season? How much should we see on your side? You gonna see every, everything you seen last year, but just better. Okay, and what have you been working on this off season? <laughs> everything I need to work on throughout the off season. I work on everything. Cause I don't see one thing that I need to work on. I work on everything so I can get better at everything at the same time. In terms of your off-season training, then what does that look like in terms of your regimen, how you've gone about things leading up to today? It looked way better than the game. My off-season <laughs> training is just harder. Let's go, let's awesome. go, Trav. Okay, and then in terms of your development, looking forward, what's next? For you? Yeah, you're gonna see a great player. That's it. Awesome. Well, you've heard it here from Travis Hunter. Travis, thank you for your time. No problem. No problem. Good luck tonight. Yes, sir. Hey, let's go. Hey, wait, wait, wait. I want to. I want to. I want to. Let me say something. Fear this. Fear. Wanna, yes, let me get one. Let's get one. No, nah, I was never nervous. I was always that kid that would want to go play no matter what I had to do. Oh my God, bro. I think we won four games my freshman year. And then my sophomore year, we won six, I think. And then my junior year, we won 12. And this year, about to happen. But the growth is really, it, it stepped all the way up. Yeah, we're not one of the powerhouses. We, we really get everybody that's around this, around Collins City area. But Grayson was really just that powerhouse in Georgia and Milton. Yeah, they played most of the ESPN games. Yeah, we I think we got an ESPN game this year. No, we never won a state championship. Last year was actually our first time getting that far in the playoffs, getting to the state championship. I think we the, the farthest we got was to the semifinals. So last year we really made history. Keep your confidence, your mental right, and stay out of the way. And just believe, ride your own wave, as I say. I say ride your own wave. Don't hop on nobody else's wave. You're not really like motivated too much by the money, but. No, nah, I'm not motivated by the money. I just want to be able to help, help out a lot of people. All right, come on, now you should already, you know the answer to that one. Let's go. I had a play. There ain't no way to be playing with. Time to get right. Time to get right, man. Time to get right. Hey, let's eat, boy. Let's eat. Time to get right, man. Man, let's go, man. Get the picture. Get the picture. We're ready. Oh, shit. Good job, man. 
Nah, I don't talk trash. I don't say nothing to nobody unless they start talking to me. Once you start talking to me and you know you're not better than me, it's just a bad, it's just a bad thing for you because I'm finna give you my all. Like, I'm about to go past what I normally do. Make your journey different to, than anybody else. Like, don't worry about what anybody else is doing. Do what you gotta do to get to the next level. If you ride somebody else's wave, you'll be falling behind somebody else. You, you should be wanting to be the leader. Don't look to the left, look to the right. You just gotta go straight down the middle and grind. I'm just being smart right now. Okay. okay. Yeah, I guess. There. Appreciate you. You a dog. Appreciate you. <laughs> Y'all yeah, stay locked in though. Come on. The game too close. You good. Mm -mm. Three cause of me. I dropped the pick. First drive, I dropped the pick. We both dropped the pick. And, uh, and, but uh, not on the first drive. You didn't drop no, it on the, the first drive. first drive, I extended the drive. It was third down. Yeah. Play. But I dropped the pick too. I'm gonna run that score right now. I feel good. I feel like I'm gonna go out there and get like at least two or three more. I gotta get, I gotta get open more. And then I'm gonna go lock up number 89. He's gonna catch me more fast. So did you know about them already, or was that Joby that did that? He was holding me the whole way down the field. He was holding me all the way down the field. 
running. I'm running. I'm not touching him. I'm saying. I told y'all, man. It's me. I just told y'all. This is the first one. Only the first one. Only the first one. We're gonna have a good one for you next time too. Only the first one too. Easy work. And they really trust me and they want me to come in and work for my spot. They ain't just gonna give me a spot. Uh -huh. You think there's any chance you play both ways in college? Yeah, or? I play both ways. Pretty, I'm pretty sure they're gonna let me play both ways. Wide receiver DB? Yeah, I'm gonna play wide receiver DB. Alright, man. Good luck. No problem. Thank you. Appreciate it. Anybody else need a? Hey, Alright, enemy? Cool. Shut up, man. Hey, Chad, let me get a pick. This environment was pretty different. Last time we played at our home field, it wasn't this, it wasn't this packing, it wasn't this loud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> and right away you picked off the pass, is that? <laughs> yeah, that's, that's how we game plan it was for me to roll down in safety because they like to throw deep with number 89 a lot, so I just played over top. Whenever you want to score, you can score. Does it feel like that at, at certain times? Yeah, times? I always feel like that. I know I can score every time I touch the ball. Tell me about Florida State. Where do they kind of see you? In the, in that's the, all I want to see. And in terms of you, you know, um, what, do you, what are your goals for this season? I ain't got no personal goals. I want to get my team back to the state championship and win it. Okay. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. I want to walk through in the suite. ESPN want to interview you in the suite. All right, hold on, you tell them all. Your arms long? Ah. Work, Appreciate you. All right, good morning. I'll see you later. Come on. What's up? Hey, grandma. What's up, bro? Appreciate you. Yeah, two touchdowns, a pick, and I had two leading blocks. So it was pretty. It was a pretty successful game for me. You feel like you're the best player in the country? I'm the best player in the country, man. I don't feel like I know I am. This game. It's going to be another movie. It's just going to be better, though. Every week going to get better and better. Appreciate you. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Thank you, bro. We go right here. We go to the suite. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Thank you. Come on, Tyler. Hey, come on. Nick. Water, Coke. Water. I want to drink soda. Yeah, you're damn right. Straight out, Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. How do you come from this game now after doing what you did? What are your thoughts? Let's go one and on next week. <laughs> That's it. Hey, 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 hey,
Yeah, like what advice would you give? What I give, what advice I give to is keep your confidence, your mental right, and stay out of the way, and just believe, ride your own way. As I say, I say, ride your own way. Don't hop on nobody else's way. Uh, don't hop on nobody else's way. What about in terms of like uh, working out, like uh, working training? Out, you should be working out. You should be working out at least three times a week, at least three times a week, two times a day. And the last one. What's your favorite quote or, well, actually two of them. What's your favorite quote? Ride your own way, don't ride nobody else's way. And I'm a finesse. I like to do, I like to finesse. So I always use, I'm a finesse. Uh, what, even though the journey is not done, what is the journey taught you up to now? You said what? The, even though like the journey of playing football isn't done yet, what have you learned up to now? Uh, what I have learned is you got to have that confidence no matter what. You have a good confidence, you can, your journey will keep going. And you just got to have a narrow road. Don't look to the left, look to the right. You just got to go straight down the middle and grind. Um, can you talk a little bit more about your quote? Like, what does that mean to you? I'm a finesse. I'm a finesse it's because. No, like, no, no, the, the writing, the. Your oh, own ride your own way. Yeah. Ride your own way is just like make make your journey different to it than anybody else. Like, don't worry about what anybody else is doing. Do what you gotta do to get to the next level. If you ride somebody else's way, you'll be falling behind somebody else. You would, you should be wanting to be the leader. Uh, what do you say? Like, do you usually initiate like a trash talk? that you do or? <laughs> nah, I don't talk trash. I don't say nothing to nobody unless they start talking to me. Once you start talking to me and you know you're not better than me, it's just a bad, it's just a bad thing for you because I'm finna give you my all. Like, I'm about to go past what I normally do. Two plates? I feel like we should have got a different plate. He might. Hell no. Well, get mad if I eat with no shirt on? <laughs> you picked them up? You can have them. Walton versus Lounge. Walton. Score. What's the score? I told her, mm -mm, don't put them on my plate. Mm -mm. Mm, I don't know what that season is. That's some other stuff right now. The season was looking like pressure. <laughs> <laughs> they still playing, ain't they? Playing it. 
Yeah, put the seeds up on the top of that. Gotta butter the bread, Billy. God. If you don't butter your bread, you. There's no what difference, man. It tastes the same. Yeah. Yes, it do. Butter does not add anything. Wait, what does butter add? No, that's not soft, bro. They did their thing today. Yeah, look, same chicken. Yeah, but it's it's the like thinness to it. Yeah, it's thinner. Did you take my water? Yo, bro, stop using me of everything. Yes, you did. 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 Yes, They different breeds, they red breeds. Hey, watch out. I like to go out and laugh, so we're gonna have to get to the back. I like to be laughing. Come on, now you should already, you know the answer to that one. Let's go. Trying to get paid, man. Trying to get paid in the garden. You know how I'm feeling. I'm feeling real good. I'm just ready to get out of the field right now. I'm trying to, I'm gonna go ahead and get these boys right quick before we even step on the field for you. So go ahead and get that work. Team already lit. The boys already lit. The boys ready. Boys ready. Trying to get paid today, baby. We ain't somebody had a place. We ain't no one to be playing with. Let's go, man. Time to get right. Time to get right, man. Time to get right. Let's eat, boy. Let's eat. Time to get right, man.
Oh, he did get up. Right there. Niggas wrong That nigga arm just shot up. That's the only person who wants to do it. Hell yeah. All 10 points for me right now. That's the all 10 points for me. You good? Mm-mm. Three because of me. I dropped the pick. First drive, I dropped the pick. We both dropped the pick. But not on the first drive. You didn't drop the pick. No, the first drive, I extended the drive. It was cut down. Yeah. But I dropped the pick too. I got a second half. It's, it's my first one. 